Hey guys, good morning. So I need some answers and I need a little bit of help, right? So only speaking for me, because that's the only thing that I can do. If my man comes to me three o'clock in the morning, four o'clock, 10 o'clock, it doesn't matter what time, it's like, babe, can you fix me something to eat? I am getting my butt up and fixing him something to eat. If he hands me a freaking orange and it's like, babe, can you peel this? Not only will I be peeling it, but I will separate it and hand it to him or give it to him and ask him, do you want something with this? Like these actions do not belittle me or make me small or put me under him. That's my man. Like I don't understand and I, I can't put it together why these things are so hard or start arguments like what <sighs> because a lot of these modern women uh think that that's beneath them that's the problem but these are the same women that would expect the man to jump up at three o'clock in the morning if somebody's trying to break in the house see it doesn't make sense but this is what a lot of women have been told they have been told that anything that you do for your man has to be on your terms. If you don't feel like making a sandwich, I'm not making no sandwich. I'm not cutting your orange. Those little bitty things that you do for men are the things that men appreciate the most. One of the biggest things that men appreciate again are the smallest little things. Babe, you made me a sandwich, that's great. Yeah, honey, I want to make sure you don't go hungry when you're at work. Babe, you made dinner? Yes, I wanted to make sure you had something hot to eat when you came home because I know you've been working hard all day. But see, women, they expect trophies. A lot of these women, they expect to get trophies. They expect to get little stickers like they're in the second grade. I've been at home taking care of the kids all day. Where's my recognition? Where's my stars? Your stars and your recognition come from the money that he's putting out of his pocket to provide for you and give you a nice house and to put that food in the refrigerator that you don't want to cook. You see, that's the thing. How can you expect a man to appreciate you when you can't even appreciate him by showing him little bitty things? Men don't ask for much. Men don't expect women to jump through a 50 million hoops. Men ask for small little things and many times men don't even ask for it. It's when the woman comes out and she does, just does it, it makes men feel good. It makes men feel like they're appreciated. If you're in a relationship with a man and you don't even wanna make him a sandwich, why is it you expect him to pay for bills? Why is it you expect him to go grocery shop, give you money to go grocery shopping? Why do you expect him to pay for your car insurance, to buy your car, to do all these things? But when it comes to women doing something for their man, their husband, it's an issue. How dare you expect me to cook you, a, to make you a sandwich? A sandwich? That is the smallest thing you can do. He's not asking you to go walk a tightrope on a power line. He's not asking you to go out every single day and do a dangerous job that might cost your life. He's not asking you to do that. He's asking you to show small things that show your appreciation. Honey, I know you're going to work all day. I'm gonna make sure you have something to eat. How is that a bad thing? You see women, have been lying to women for so long that these women actually think that those type of little things are beneath them. And this is what's a, one of the reasons why a lot of these women are single, because they don't want to do relationship things. They only want relationship benefits. Again, they don't want to do relationship things. They only want relationship benefits. They expect men to do all the things that men are supposed to do and they don't have to do anything but exist, lay on their back and let a man do let a man do what he wants to do and then that's it. They don't have to cook, they don't have to clean, they don't have to show any appreciation for anything. They don't. But they expect men to want to stay with them, be loyal to them, 
provide for them, etc., etc., etc. Again, men do not ask for a lot. Men ask for the bare minimum. Men don't have a lot of demands. Women do. Modern women do. Men don't. If you do the small things for men, he will appreciate you forever and he will work that much harder to give you everything that you want. But if you think that doing these little things like making sandwiches, cleaning up your house, which by the way are things that you should already be doing for yourself, you know, maybe do the laundry, your ass is home all single day and you can't find enough energy to do that, but you can find all the energy in the world to do this shit. If you can't do that, you're going to be unhappy and you're going to be single. And for those of you ladies that say, well, I don't need no man to do this. Okay. Then you can make your own sandwiches. You can pay your own rent. You can protect yourself. Don't expect men to protect you or to do anything for you. Don't expect men to do anything traditional for you. If you're so damn independent and you don't want to give a man even an inkling of appreciation. Be by yourself. Stop trying to be in relationships with men because this type of thing is never going to change. It is a biological thing. This shit has been happening since the dawn of time. Men went out there and slayed the dragons. If dragons actually existed or they went out there and they slayed the big game, cut the meat up, brought the meat home. Women cooked. The women made sure everything was right. All the clothes were washed, the kids were good, all these things. This is what women have done throughout time. It's only in the last 50, 60 years, really in the last 20 years, that it's become this, this competition with women. I'm not doing that. That's beneath me. Well, like I just said, if you don't want to show appreciation and you don't want to show some traditional things, you don't want to be in your feminine nature, then stop trying to be in relationships. Leave men alone and just go it alone. Be independent by yourself. Because you don't want to do nothing for nobody but yourself. So just be by yourself. You have the power to achieve anything you want. Don't let anything or anyone distract you from your goals. And remember, stay focused, stay strong, and stay positive. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share this video with those in need.